So neighborhood beautification matters because that's where our residents are, right? Because it's their, their homes and their families with their pets where the, the heartbeat happens. During those early years of the projects, we really began to see neighbors started taking pride in their neighborhoods. Residents began to see how they can reimagine spaces in their neighborhood. So it sort of started taking off from there. And now with these beautiful hand-painted portraits to line this new fence of ours, um, it's now a place of destination. This is something that we can do to help uplift the, the neighborhood and bring a part of history back. I'm so grateful for the honor. And even though I turned 70 this year, I ain't stopping. I want to thank the Harper Foundation for the vision and trusting us to bring forth this project to this community. We actually decided to do the project immediately after the shooting of a three-year-old and a 16-year-old on the same day. It's such a joy to add to the neighborhood to show that we're not a body of destruction, but of beauty, hope, and healing. One of my favorite quotes is from the rapper Tupac, and he says something about a rose that grows from concrete. There's a lot of talent in, in Hartford, and there's a lot of untapped talent. And if somebody just encouraged them, to do good, that maybe it would be that push or that motivation that they need. This was not um, individuals from the city coming in and saying, here's what we want to do in your neighborhood. These were the neighbors saying, this is what I want in my neighborhood. This gave them an opportunity to do what they loved in their community with their neighbors. All the while they were civically engaged and they had no idea. We put it out to the community that you could nominate a hero in Frog Hollow. It was the, the most passionate outpouring I have seen for any project we've done. So we had two community engagement days where people could come and people painted. The community engagement is as important as that finished mural because people remember being part of that. I found out about my own mural, I think through the uh, Facebook. I was so surprised. I really want the message of these murals to tell the community that volunteering should be number one, getting involved in your community to make a difference should be part of that as well. I think it's a great honor. She's been part of this community for uh, you know over 30 years. You know, just very proud. She's still working on a lot of projects, so she's not done yet. You know. It just warms my heart to think of how and where we can go with all these projects. In order for us to thrive as a city, we have to have beautiful neighborhoods where our residents are proud to call home. And I think it's just all part of the ecosystem of having a great city.